In this video, we're going to look at the bearish engulfing pattern. The bearish engulfing candlestick pattern is just the opposite of the bullish. And you want to find, uh, on the bearish engulfing pattern, you want to look for it at a top, at a peak, at a resistance. Uh, you want to find overbought conditions. And that's where the pattern is most effective. Um, you don't want to get into a bearish engulfing pattern at a bottom. Generally speaking, a bearish engulfing at the bottom it usually are the last players coming in trying to uh, uh, trying to get in on what's already taken place. Those are the latecomers. Those are the guys that allow people who are already in to get out with a profit. So in order to use a bearish engulfing pattern successfully, look for it again at tops, at peaks, and in overbought conditions. So what you're looking at is this, you know, series of candlesticks up. The pattern consists of two candlesticks. But what you're looking for is a, a nice move up to resistance or a nice move up to a um a new high, okay? Uh, it could be a lower high, uh it could be a higher high uh, as far as swing highs are concerned, but you want a move up. You want to see the pattern and you want to see the first candlestick in the pattern to be completely engulfed by the next bearish candlestick and the psychology behind the bearish engulfing opposite of the bullish is is that uh, you get an open and close higher on the la on the first candlestick in the pattern consistent with basically the rest of the price action um, before it and then you get a higher open which you know initially you're anticipating another move up and then price moves down and closes below the open of the previous candlestick so that this real body completely engulfs the um, last bullish candlesticks real body and that's the bearish engulfing pattern